Hi, I'm Rachel Pope, physical therapist and certified yoga teacher with runyogatherapy.com. Today we're going over kinesio taping or rock taping techniques to help support the pregnant belly. Um, this is going to be a combination technique. Um, so if you're looking for sort of more support, okay. So the first strip we're going to do is sort of under the belly like this. So just measuring out how much tape I need and cutting it. I'm going to round the ends of the tape. That will help prevent it from uh, peeling up prematurely. And then, so for this first strip, we're going to tear right in the center, revealing the tape on the inside. Be being careful not to touch the tape if you can help it, because that will decrease the stickiness of it. So this first piece of tape, what we're going to do is we're going to put sort of low on the belly. This will just form a belly sling. Okay, so nice and low here. And pressing it down. And then peeling up the side. Okay, so getting some tension there like this. All the way up on the side like that. And then you're going to do the same thing on the other. So tension, pulling it up. Deactivate that and then paper off to light, no tension on the other side. Okay, so you can do this as a standalone technique by itself with a single strip, or you can do one or two more strips so that you have three all together supporting underneath the belly. Um, but for this one, what we're going to do is kind of a max support from the hip across the belly towards the um, towards the rib cage. Okay, so cutting another piece of tape here. And I'm actually going to cut two of them. So two pieces of tape. And then rounding the edges on both pieces. For this, for these two strips, what you're going to do is tear the paper towards the end and peel off that end piece, okay? And then you're going to find that hip bone. You're going to start at the hip bone, lay that down. No tension for the first inch or so. And then peeling the tape all the way almost to the end so that you can still hold on to the paper. And then you're going to come right across that belly button with a good amount of tension. Okay, can you see there I'm pulling right across and up towards the rib cage. So no tension on the end, laying it down nice and flat. Okay, and then you're gonna repeat that with the other, on the other side. Okay, so peeling just the end, find that ASIS or that hip bone. And yes, sometimes we do need to touch the end of the tape, but Try to minimize that as much as possible. So coming from that hip bone there, you can hardly see what I'm doing because my belly's so big. Okay, so no tension there. And then, right, so we're gonna peel the tape almost to the end, give it a good amount of stretch, come right across the belly button, and then up and over on the other side. No tension on the end and then just lay that down flat, okay? So this is gonna be a nice supportive technique um, to decrease the weight of the belly that you might be feeling. That will help decrease low back pain. Um, and this kind of across the front here, you know, if you feel like your belly's sort of splitting apart, which um, you know, a lot of women feel that way, the linea alba between the rectus abdominis, that muscle in the front, does need to open a bit, you know, to accommodate for your growing baby. Um, this will kind of help pull things together and it will also help you give you some proprioceptive input for activating your abdominal muscles as well. Um, and that in effect will help kind of decrease your low back pain. If you're looking for any other techniques to try for alleviating pain, alleviating um, low back pain, SI joint pain, even uh, round ligament pain, um, this you can check out some of my other videos on my YouTube channel, or you can head over to runyogatherapy.com where I have all the videos in one place um, with text descriptions as well. Thanks for watching.